do the quiz before you watch this video. This is question number eight from quiz one on my website, www.goprocaribbean. The quiz can be found at www.goprocaribbean slash dive dash physics dash two. It makes way more sense if you try and answer the questions from the quiz before you look at the answers on this video. So this question is a question about a diver consuming air. The question is about minutes. It's comparing to the surface, so the one, two, three approach on its own is gonna work. I've added a little twist. Now the diver is at depth and moving up. But anyway, step one, we're gonna look at the answers. It's in minutes. We're gonna look at the question, find the minutes and enter in the number 20 that we find in the question. Now we need to think about it. Do we multiply or divide? So this time we're starting at depth and going up to the surface. Will our air last us more time at the surface than it would at depth or less time? Hopefully you're thinking the air will last me way longer at the surface than it would at 90 meters. So I'm gonna multiply and you can enter that in in step two. Now, step three, we look at the depth in the question. The depth is 90 meters. Whoa, way too deep for recreational diving. Learn to tech dive, www.roatantechteam.com is where you can find out how to do that. Anyway, it's 90 meters, 10 atmospheres using the depth pressure chart. So we got 20 times 10 equals what? That's our answer. Well, 20 times 10 equals 200. So the correct answer will be answer B, 200 minutes. Don't forget, subscribe to my YouTube channel, like my Facebook page, GoPro Caribbean. I'm gonna be releasing exclusive content to people who like that page. Make sure you do.